Welcome to the channel, everybody. Now, today, I'm going down into the abandoned bunker to run a little test. So, let's get straight into it, shall we? So, today, I decided to test the difference between a bulletproof vest and a stabproof vest up against a razor. Now, logically, a stabproof vest should give you quite good protection against these guys. Obviously, their main form of attack is stabbing. Oh, hello. Didn't hear you jump down then. Alright, get you off. I'm not taking any damage from that yet. And then we'll just get into like a fist fight with him. Okay, so bulletproof first. Three hits. We're taking about 10% damage each time, 11% damage. And on the third hit, we got knocked out. All passed out. Okay, surprisingly taking a bit longer to go down than I thought I would. It's because we're too close in proximity to this guy, if you know what I mean. I don't want to get too far away because he'll jump on us. You don't want just want the melee. Are you missing me? Yeah, you are. Oh, there you go. Right then, so we'll respawn and go back down with a stab proof vest this time. So let's head down here. Do exactly the same thing. We're gonna run into this room and we'll attract one into here. You have to do this again. Just bear with me. And uh, one should jump down in a second. Oh, I had to get rid of a puppet, but we didn't take any damage. He did the same thing at the beginning as well and jumped on us, so it's a fair test at the moment. So three hits, no damage. Four. Fifth hit, we got damage. Sixth hit, we got damage. Seventh, we got damage. But as you can see, 90% on our bulletproof and 55% on our stamp proof. So, yeah, your bulletproof's gonna last a lot longer, but you're gonna die probably a bit quicker in a bulletproof vest rather than a stab proof vest. So, you're better off probably taking a stab proof vest if you want that extra protection and you're not bothered about your inventory slots. There you go. So, all in all, Taking a stab proof vest down there with you is probably going to give you a little longer survivability rate than what a bulletproof vest would. On the other hand, you are going to lose eight slots of inventory space by not taking a bulletproof vest. Because with a stab proof vest, one, it weighs 4kg. Secondly, it has no inventory space. So you are going to lose that, obviously, when you go down with one. But... As you saw initially, we got away with not being damaged straight away in the first three hits, as well as passing out with a stab proof vest on over a bulletproof vest. So, a few things to take away from this, if you will, and I hope you enjoyed it. Just a quick shout out to our channel members Mega Hoof, Mary G, Alti, Nectar940, and Phoenix. Thank you very much for your extra ongoing support. It's always appreciated. If you did enjoy the video, give it a like, hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you stay up to date with the latest scum news, guides, and content over on the channel. Until next time, see ya!